Let's go. To the high place. Dutchman. He has my pineapple too? That fruit stealing freebooter is taking this too far. Mr. Dutchman, sir, you have to get your ship back so I can get my pineapple back. But Prawn threw out all me precious socks. No pirate worth their salt would follow a sockless captain. And if I can't round up a crew, we won't stand a chance against the Admiral. You don't need socks to be a pirate. Why, Patrick here has never worn socks a day in his life. I don't even have feet. So, if you need a couple of loyal sea dogs, Patrick and I will gladly join your crew. Socks or no socks. <laughs> all right, all right, but first, ye scallywags. You must prove that ye are real pirate material. To show that you are worthy, you must unearth a real treasure. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Earn yourselves fearsome pirate names. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And find all me sucks! I still want them back. Aye, aye, Captain Dutchman, sir! Aye, aye, Captain Dutchman, sir! What the... These guys, they think they're famous. Ow. I saw something like this at the jump bucket once. <laughs> you're fun to whack. Okay. What? I'm trying to tan. <laughs> Ouch! I'm flying! Uh-oh, I forgot to... 
pack the sunscreen. Well, I guess I could use a tan. But what if we get bleached and shrivel up? Well, I guess I could be a little paler. Gee, I hope nobody needs a lifeguard. <laughs> Will these socks pack a punch and punch, huh? You're kicking too much sand in my mouth. I already ate some. Ooh -oh. Ouch! I regret nothing. Socks. The sock is definitely cheese flavor. Hey, make like a beach ball and go somewhere else. Punishment of magic.
Give me a magic box. Chafing. up for a sun bath, but if you could hurry, that would be great. <sighs> Larry's tired. SpongeBob? Patrick? You're here too? I thought it was just me and the anchovies. How did we get here? Huh, his fingers are green. Well, we can talk about that later. What's important right now is getting you and the anchovies and my pineapple back to Bikini Bottom. Say, where are the anchovies? That obnoxious shrimp rounded us up and made his jelly minions stick us to shipwrecks all over the lagoon. He said we're not pirate material. It isn't my fault I have a severe eye patch allergy. Don't lose heart, Larry. We're going to rescue every bikini bottomite who's stuck here, or our names aren't SpongeBob and Patrick the, the pirate guys. That's not a very fearsome pirate name. Ah, we're working on it. Thank you, SpongeBob. I'm going home to tan and pump. Oh, 
Give you a glowing review. I believe in you, almost. I want to acquire a Vanchovy. We save them and they have like a concert or something. Look at 
all these abandoned ships, Patrick. Ooh, I'll bet if we dusted off these wrecks and hoisted his socks up their flagpoles, it would look like the Dutchman has a whole armada. Then everyone would know he's back. SpongeBob, that's a pretty good plan, but flagpoles don't have any feet. How are you going to get the socks on? Very carefully, Patrick. Let's go. Goodbye, muffles. Put that jelly in my belly. Sandcastle. Must be where the king of sand lives. <laughs> Will these socks back a plunge and plunge, huh? Thank <laughs> you. 
never seen a fish like this. Young lad, this sure is your lucky day. Pinza Rosa. I knew it, but why? I've asked ye before ye stand to notorious pirate captain Pinza Rosa. I need some saps, I mean a crew, who can haul, I mean share, me treasure, I mean... Wait, no, yeah, I meant treasure that time. Oh boy, treasure! Right! Well, you seem deserving and present. Now, to share me treasure, you'll first have to get it out of an old shipwreck. It ran off course and hit some rocks in the middle of the lagoon. Someone who was totally not me must have been holding the map upside down. Anyhow, I would get the treasure myself, but <laughs> I'm far too rich to do a crewman's work. Lucky day indeed, Patrick. With that treasure, we can prove we're real pirates. Technically, you won't be, though. I can't be bothered with the bureaucracy of registering a new crew. Or paying for them. Will we at least get real pirate names? Sure, why not? Then we're... ready! Didn't we already learn this? <laughs> so do we.
more coin. How else am I going to buy a few sources? so glum uh because i like totally lost my joy and without it i can't sing which is like totally not cool for mermaids and stuff maybe it's in your fridge whenever i need joy i can always find it in my fridge the last time i had my joy was like when i was like dancing with my girlfriends but they're not like here and even if they like were there's no music but music is everywhere. All you need are some instruments in your hands and a little rhythm in your heart. SpongeBob, let's make some music. Then maybe we could go on a dance date? Sure. Like, as a friend? Uh, I promised myself I'd never date a balloon again. Also, I'm, like, way more into dating pirates now anyway. What about balloon pirates? Come on, Patrick. I'll bet we can find some stuff floating around that we can use as instruments. Then we can serve up some music. <laughs> I don't get it. Purple, blue, red, green. Gotcha, cover my buns. problem to show my gratitude i will grant you like a wish or whatever i wish that spongebob and i could reach the treasure on the grounded ship so we could become like you know like like totally date worthy pirates like have a safe flight my melodic friends Travel seems a little unsafe. I like it because it's squishy. Whee.
Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you and me. Uh-oh, not two. You're alive? I mean, welcome back! You truly earned your pirate names! From now on, you shall call yourselves... I don't know. Whatever you can think of. Hey, you never said there'd be thinking involved. I have a mermaid to impress, so you better make good on your promise. Come about with that volume, me airheaded lad, before you alert the lagoon guard. They're a ruthless bunch who'll stop at nothing to get their fins on me treasure. So, of course you'll be compensated for all your thinking with this beautifully crafted treasure chest. Contents not included. Wow, the chest is the best part. Anything you put in a treasure chest becomes treasure. I should let Gary sleep in there. Okay, fine. But I still want a cool pirate name. <laughs> Open the doors for us. That could have been way harder. Indeed. Yeah. 
Say my five things. Still pack a punch, no?
<laughs> so gooey. Boom appetit! <laughs> 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 Bob, thank Neptune. How did you get here? Fred? Eh, the usual. Magical bubbles, reckless wishing, tearing apart the very fabric of space and time. I won't bore you with the details. Just know that we are here to set things straight. Oh, good. These restraints are so tight, I can't feel my leg anymore. Oh, that's... Uh, I think your leg will be okay, as long as you stay away from termites. So the my leg guy is called Fred. Didn't know that. that you fun. really are my best friend. Boom appetit! <laughs> Look out for pies! We do have a real treasure chest. The Dutchman Sock Treasure! The finest pirate I ever knew went by Jeff. So you can be... the oh, I don't know. Square One! That's not fair! I wanted to be Square One! Well, you can be... Square Two? Sure! Whatever! Oh, Battle Shark! How oh, I missed you. All right, you're part of me crew now. It'll be grueling, mind-numbing, and repetitive, just like cleaning a litter box. <laughs> Square one, 
Use the wind bongos and flying boats to get yourselves onto me ship. Once on board, hoist me last shot and fire the huge cannon. That should signal me old crew to join us and revel in the destruction of... <laughs> Dismissal? The dismissal of Admiral Prawn! <laughs> Still pack a punch, no? Leaving this here. 